the money flip. Oh, yeah. I geek on the bitch, ay. I geek on the bitch, ay. I geek on the bitch, I geek on the bitch, I geek on the bitch, ay. I geek on the bitch. Yo, what's going on, YouTube? It's your boy Monty. And today I want to show you guys how to fix the NBA 2K17 load up screen. I know this has ha been happening to a lot of you guys, even to me. So whenever you would load up, it would either get stuck at the um, team logo screen or you won't even be able to connect to the uh, 2K servers for some reason. Not sure why. 2K is honestly just broken. So, but I really want to show you guys how to fix your 2K if it's if it won't load up or it gets stuck at the screen so if it gets stuck at the team logo screen what you want to do is you want to hit start over 2k and go to manage game and once that loads up you're going to just scroll down to save data it's going to show your profiles that's on your account that's with 2k and you just go right down to reserve space and what you do is hover over that you hit the start button and it brings up clear reserve space so after you clear the reserve space you load up the game and what it will do is clear any reserve space that's just holding on 2k that's just taking up too much space what it's going to do is sit at the main menu and it's going to have you wait for the uh, reserve space to clear and what you want to do is not hit cancel. What you do is do not hit cancel. If you do hit cancel, it's going to corrupt your My Player file and like your whole account. And you have to wait for it to say update required. Now, I've seen people do this before, but sometimes it took hours for people to get an update required. So I would advise you to not do that. And when it's done clearing reserve space, you're going to see that um, spinny um, ball load up. At, like in the corner of the screen and it's gonna work right after that now when you can't connect to the 2k servers what I did was I literally just closed out the game hit quit and what I would do is go to settings and just go down to restart console it basically just reboots your whole console and not putting it to sleep because most people just turn off their Xbox and turn it right back on. And what that does is just put it to sleep. You're not really turning it off. So what I do is just restart the console, load it back up, wait a little bit, and then load up 2K. And there you go, it works. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this and really hope it works for you guys. Give it a like and comment and subscribe and I'm out.